For those of you who have been watching Underworld videos for a while, you know how dangerous our planet can be. Storms, volcanoes, tsunamis, earthquakes, the list of deadly things just doesn't seem to stop. But what if we were to take it up a notch and talk about things that exist outside of our planet? Cosmic forces that could wipe us out in an instant. At any given moment, there are millions of asteroids flying through our solar system, varying in size and shape. The vast majority of them are located in the asteroid belt located between Mars and Jupiter. But there are a number of them that are constantly orbiting the Sun and crossing our planet's orbital path. We would like to tell you how many there are, but the truth is, nobody knows. As a matter of fact, it's estimated that there are hundreds of thousands of asteroids crossing our path that we don't even know exist. For the ones that we do know of, it paints a picture of what is exactly possible in our solar system. Here are five asteroids that scientists are worried about. One potentially dangerous asteroid that astronomers have their eye on is named 1990MU. It is one of many asteroids that are known as Apollo-class asteroids. This means that they have an orbital path around the Sun that takes it through the orbital path of the Earth. In other words, there is a chance that one day in the future, it could cross our path at the wrong time and make contact with our planet, resulting in some pretty terrible things. Measuring just over 2 miles in diameter, 1990MU is flying through space at a speed of about 23 kilometers per second and orbiting the Sun every 754 days. It has been classified as a potentially hazardous asteroid due to its predicted close passes with Earth. The scariest part of this asteroid is its enormous size. Based on its brightness and the way it reflects light, 1990MU is estimated to be between 1.66 to 3.7 miles in diameter, making it larger than 99% of all asteroids. For comparison, this is roughly the size of the island of Manhattan. NASA and other scientific communities have tracked this asteroid for some time and feel confident that it poses very little threat to the Earth, but nothing is for certain. The next time it'll come close to us, it'll pass around 2.8 million miles away. Now this may seem like a large number, but remember, it's space. This is actually very close. Also, considering its size, 2.8 million miles is still too close for comfort. On the morning of September 1st, 2017, astronomers were able to bear witness to an incredibly awesome event. An asteroid named 3122 Florence flew past Earth at a distance of only 4.4 million miles. NASA stated that nothing of that size had ever passed that close to Earth since tracking began. Telescopes were able to pick up the asteroid with relative ease as it whizzed by Earth, only to be flung out into the reaches of space again. Why is this particular asteroid of concern, though? Well, just like 1990 MU, it is an Apollo-class asteroid, crossing over the orbital path of Earth. Also, it is an incredibly large asteroid, measuring roughly 2.7 miles wide. To date, only about 10 asteroids as big as Florence exist in near-Earth space. But, as we said before, we have a very light grasp on exactly how many dangerous objects exist in space that would pose a threat to Earth. During this particular encounter, there was never any chance of the huge space rock hitting our planet. Astronomers have even mapped out Florence's orbit for the future and know that, at least for the next few hundred years, there is no danger to anyone living on Earth. However, should something as large as Florence actually strike Earth, it would be very bad. Scientists regard any asteroid with a diameter of at least 0.6 miles across to be capable of ending civilization. For this entry, we have asteroid 999942, also known as Apophis. Now, this is the perfect example of astronomers only knowing about a small fraction of the threats we face from outer space. Apophis was only discovered in the year 2004. At first, it didn't seem like much of a big deal because it only measures a thousand feet across. However, as its speed and trajectory were further studied, a panic set in because it seemed as if there may be an impact from this asteroid in the year 2029. After searching through some older astronomical images and studies, scientists ruled out the possibility of an impact. Rather, it would make an incredibly close pass that year. This pass won't be measured in millions of miles or even hundreds of thousands of miles. Rather, it will pass by at around 19,600 miles from the Earth's surface. 
While that is a safe distance, it's close enough that it'll come between the Earth and the Moon. Even scarier is that at that distance, there are some spacecraft that orbit the Earth. That year, the asteroid will be visible to the naked eye. Apophis will pass over the southern hemisphere and will look like a speck of light moving from east to west across the night sky. After moving across Australia, it'll go over the Indian Ocean, cross the equator in Africa, and keep going over the Atlantic. Another potentially dangerous asteroid floating around in space is 1998 QS52, a medium-sized asteroid that is also classified as an Apollo-class asteroid. This stony asteroid has a very pronounced elliptical orbit around the Sun and travels at a pretty high speed as it comes closer. It was discovered on August 25, 1998 by astronomers of the Linear Program at Lincoln Laboratory's experimental test site, but this discovery set off a number of alarms. You see, this asteroid is estimated to be between 2.5 and 5 miles in diameter, making it one of the largest asteroids ever discovered. To give you a bit of scale, this asteroid measures around the same size of the San Francisco Bay. Although it will be considered a close call when it passes by Earth in 2038, the reality is that it will be over 7 million miles away. Just as before, this is a very large distance when measured by humans. However, space is much different. 7 million miles is an incredibly short distance. Slight variations in its trajectory could spell disaster without a larger distance to act as a buffer. 16 to 32 feet across is definitely not a huge size asteroid by any means. As a matter of fact, on a cosmic scale, it's barely worth mentioning. But that was the size of asteroid 2020 VT4. So how did an asteroid so small make this list? Well, that has to do with the fact that it was moving incredibly fast and was only discovered hours before it shot over our skies. That's right, one of the biggest threats to our planet is asteroids that travel towards us from the direction of the Sun. While it is extremely uncommon, it does happen from time to time, leaving us with very little warning in case something has to go incredibly wrong. Now there was another thing that made this asteroid incredibly dangerous. The distance that it missed our planet by was 400 miles. Never before has a near-Earth asteroid ever come that close. This was a big wake-up call for scientists. If this asteroid was able to get close without being seen, then another one could do the same thing. The only difference is that the next one could be much bigger and pose a much greater threat. Luckily for us, this wasn't one of those times, but the approach did have a big effect on the space rock. Because of how close it came to Earth, its elliptical path around the Sun was changed quite a bit. Now, there will not be another encounter with 2020 VT4 until November of 2052. Space has no shortage of dangers to give us here on Earth. While we are constantly tracking the cosmos, looking for dangerous objects like asteroids and comets, we have to be on our guard for the unseen threats that seem to come out of nowhere. But as science progresses, so will our awareness and safety. Be sure to click the link on screen now to check out another one of our videos just like this one. With that, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe to see more videos just like this.